Hey everyone, today's video is just going to be kind of an informative video. Um, I've posted quite a few seatbelt alarm or chime disable videos and they do get quite a bit of hate. People, you know, just want you just wear the seatbelt, that kind of crap. Um, one thing I didn't really mention in the videos is I also did it on my passenger seat. So you can sit on the passenger seat without having the alarm go off. And one reason I did that, so as you can see, my wet Rottweiler is over there chilling out. Now, if I turn the truck on, passenger side airbag is on, which means that seat is sensing that somebody is sitting there. So it's picking up enough weight that somebody is sitting there. So if she was on this seat and uh, the seatbelt was not on, the alarm would be going off just because she's on there. And yeah, see now it's off. She just, if she moves this, if she just sits on it uh, normally, it goes on. And so yeah, when she's sitting on it, the alarm will go off. So, you know, you're driving down the road and having that alarm go off just cause your dog's with you and be kind of annoying. So that's why I did the passenger seat. And if you go back in my videos, I'll leave the links in the description. You can. Uh, click on it for your year of vehicle and just uh, follow the steps um, it's the exact same procedure for the passenger side of the vehicle as it is uh, on the driver's side so it's pretty easy to fo follow along in the videos and then you can bring your furry companion along with you and not have to worry about the alarm going off or the um, you know if you're just driving around with some friends at the creek or something whatever so yeah, um, check out those videos if you want and leave a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for some uh, future videos.